Time to go to work. Hmm. That thing looks whippable. And look what I found. I didn't spot this before. If this is the prize, I'll lose my grant for sure. Where are the priceless artifacts? The gilded idols? The crowns of kings? Good news never travels that fast. Better get up there. Now. Sophia Hapgood. Hello, Indy. Been a while. I'll say. What brings you out west? Some psychic premonition about the treasures I should have found? My, look at these wonderful pot shirts. It's the new thinking in archaeology. Find some worthless debris, analyze it, understand prehistory. Kind of noble, don't you think? There's an iron curtain coming down on Europe, Indy. The Russians are taking over. I read the papers. Want a real chance to be noble? We need your help. Uh-huh. Who's we? When I joined during the war, it was the OSS. Now President Truman calls us the Central Intelligence Agency. Is that what you're up to these days? Soviet sabotage? Atomic secrets? Don't be silly. We've got whole battalions for that. It's my job to worry about more, uh, unusual activity. Such as this dig site on the Euphrates River, south of Baghdad. Babylon. Remember your Bible? That's where mortals raised the Tower of Babel to invade heaven. Well, you know, this does look like the ruins of a Temenanki. The ziggurat often identified with the tower. Very good, Dr. Jones. You're looking at the brainchild of one Gennady Volodnikov of the Leningrad Physics Institute. He thinks there's some truth to the biblical legend. Isn't he a godless communist? He's a physicist who studies manifolds in hyperspace. Quirky theoretical stuff. But well, what's a guy like that doing in Babylon? Not sure. All we really know is he thinks the atom bomb is a joke. Then why isn't the world laughing? Indy, suppose the tower has some deadly force no one else had ever heard of. Something as dangerous as nuclear fission. And the Babylonians tore it down for reasons not discussed in the good book. Exactly. It's an amusing theory, but as you can see, I've got troubles of my own. You don't think I flew out here from Washington just to relieve your boredom, I hope. This came from the Russian dig site. Uh, somebody made a mistake. This looks like part of a steam engine. Maybe a locomotive from the last century. There's no mistake. We've dated the thing. It's 2,600 years old. Really? Look at that little wheel spin. How'd you find it? Come on, Indy, we're the CIA. We have spies. I hereby remind comrade Dr. Valodnikov that socialist theory disavows the existence of supernatural powers. Those doctrinaire apparatchiki. What is it? They think I'm out here searching for God? Possibly. I'm just decoding the message, sir. I'm searching for Marduk, a creature the Babylonians worshipped as a god, but he doesn't live in heaven, just on another plane. What kind of plane, sir? Soviet or American? Not airplane, you idiot. It's another dimension of reality. The Ethereum. Be careful, Professor. When questions of ideology arise, they often conceal doubts about methods and results. In four ministers, we're making excellent progress, all according to plan. We know the true story is waiting in the room of the tablets. That's where we'll find out what happened to the tower. 
and to the machine Marduk inspired. We are close. It's a matter of days. And damn the ideology! Quite an operation the Russians have going here. Makes me jealous. The site is crawling with guards. I better steer clear. to the checkpoint. That's my passport. Dr. Voladnikov, we have Narushitin in our sight. Capture him if possible. Otherwise, throw you the dog. That's sir. Locked. Hey, Astanavis! Strasvicha, Tavarisch. Open the door. I'm here to deliver supplies, you know, dig stuff. <laughs> Whatever you need, I've got it. What? Hello, Dr. Jones. Welcome to Babel. I'm Simon Turner. Remember? CIA? Sophia works for me. Oh, you stole the cogwheel. And our combi friends don't even know it's gone. Volodnikov's a hopeless academic, not a field man, and frankly, I need clues he doesn't have. That's why you got tapped. You are a famous archaeologist. I'm just a spy. This should get you through the door. By the way, rumor has it they found a gold statuette of the winged god Marduk. Be awful nice to have that. CIA runs a museum. The company runs a hive of soulless bureaucrats, but I am a passionate collector. I'll bet you are. Now it starts to make sense. Let's see here. Make welcome seeker. Know that it was Nebuchadnezzar, in heed of the writing uh, that Marduk made appear unto him, who builded the great engine. Having no understanding, the rabble hath thrown down his work, but four trusted disciples are, are scattered upon the face of the earth, and the relics go with them. Wouldst thou tread the path of knowledge, look eastward. Ergon it is who flees to the heavenly mountains, where Shambhala holds a mighty secret. Heavenly mountains. I wonder if that means the Tian Shan Range. Ah, Jones, there you are. Got a statue for me? Will this do? It just might. Anything else? According to the inscription, the tower once housed a great engine. When the Babylonians smashed the thing, four priests escaped with the parts. Taking them where? Not sure, except in one case. Some fellow named Ergon headed for the Heavenly Mountains. There's a crude map of Central Asia. That's not much help. Might be enough. The Tian Shan Range straddles the border between China and Kazakhstan. The name translates as Heavenly Mountains. Kazakhstan? Last time I looked, that was Soviet territory. Maybe I won't show the border guards my passport. Okay, buddy, it's your funeral.
Hey, a beeswax candle. I did. And you want my help? Do I? To tell you the truth, I'm kind of lost. But it is you who must help me. As you have guessed, a man from the desert came to us long ago with the spinning idol. For centuries we have lived with his evil legacy. Take it, and our blessing be upon you. Show me the way. I am too old and infirm. To be of any service, I must recover my former strength. And that, I am afraid, requires a certain golden treasure. Okay. Golden treasure. Where is it? Why? In the treasury, of course. Take this. It may help you. Here's the best I could do. I hope you're not disappointed. Not yet. Your gift is great. Now. Here is the way to the Babylonian curse. Return when you have cleansed the sanctuary. Beware the ice. Here, I guess this belongs to you. No, take it away. What is it, anyway? I don't know. A relic. You have found part of something terrible. Are you prepared to continue? Yeah, there's supposed to be more of these things. Although Ergon dwelt with us in Shambhala, his companion, Taklit, journeyed onward to the Eastern Ocean. There, he took advantage of a people starving for knowledge. Are you talking about the Pacific? That's a wide stretch of water. Look for a tropical island among many others, where men have lived for eons uncounted. They call it Palawan, I believe. Follow this path.
nice honor. Hard to believe anyone living here would sign up for the troubles of civilization, unless somebody or something lured them into it. Looks like this place used to be inhabited, and not by cavemen. Kinda warm in here. The volcano can't still be active, can it? Sophia, what are you doing here? Same thing you are. I found the door. Let's go. Wait! I'm not looking for a partner. Too dangerous. Who said we're partners? The company has its rules, Indy. I don't tell you everything. Be careful here. I know you don't believe in my psychic powers, but I sense danger. I've been around long enough to believe in almost anything. Even nuts like you. Don't worry, I'll dodge the commies. No, not them. Something else. Something strange. Here you are. Find anything? Nothing spooky, if that's what you mean. What's this switch? It opens the gate up there. Now let me work my way into position, then push. Say when. Push, Sophia. Indy, you okay? I can't open it from this side. Doesn't matter. I've got some spying to do. Wait! What about that premonition? Still got it? Yes. But the danger is farther along. It'll be fine. For now. I like your optimism. saw this place in any textbook, but somebody built it. Long ago, somebody built it, and then left. At least, I hope they left. Ah! Rocks move! I don't remember studying this in geology class. This wall looks like it's raining. Lava, the personality. What's this guy's body temperature? Myself, when I run a fever, I get cranky. Is this what I think it is? Let's see. Frame your mind well. Wherefore, eyes avail not. The unseen is unstoppable. Here it is. Another cog in the wheel. Sophia! Turner! Where is everybody? About time you showed up, Joan. I was almost worried. Yeah, me too. Listen, while you were hunting artifacts, I was eavesdropping on the Russians. They've given up here. Volodnikov got word about ancient machinery in the Pyramid of the Sun. Teotihuacan. Mexico. Built by some Babylonian priest. Azurum, I think. Azurum? And you might just get a jump on our friends. They're traveling by boat. territory for sure, but I'll bet Azrum found it long before I did. Why am I getting this creepy feeling? Ugh! 
<laughs> Smatri, Tavarishchi. We've captured a jungle animal. Careful now, he's a magnificent specimen. Quick, get me up on deck. I think I'm gonna be seasick. Ha ha ha! Ha ha ha! Ho ho ho! Tomarishi! Jones Obijal! What? Retake him immediately! Alive if possible, but dead if necessary. Harasho, sir. The Nile River, the Kingdom of Kush. These exotic sites are foreign to Sovietsky Grazhny, but that will change as we change the world, eh? That's where the Babylonian secret lies, buried with King Nob, who used it to defeat his Egyptian Ugnitotli. Somehow, no one has ever claimed the treasure. Is it too well hidden, too dangerous? Does the power strike the finder like a curse? I wonder about these things. Then, when my resolve weakens, we capture Jones. Now, using that Americansky adventurist and the tools he has so kindly provided, we budgem him yet uspieshny. Indeed, history is on our side. Here's where Horner ran his little railroad. I'll bet the levers control the switches. But without electric power, I can't switch the tracks. Capture if possible. Otherwise, throw you either dog. Nope. It's not safe to get out here. throw this back, just to be safe. Hmm, a third gem. Too bad I'll never get a chance to cash it in. Vladnikov up to now.
what's this? A ruby polished like a lens. Or an eye. A baleful eye. It fits. Whoa. Take it easy, big fella. I'm no grave robber. If you're willing to overlook this little incident, I am too. Ow! Indy, is that you? <sighs> More or less. Are you all right? I am one hurting archaeologist, but I'll live. Oh, good. Hand up those machine parts you've collected and we'll get you out of there. Indy? Who's we? Come on, Jones. We need those parts. Don't you love your country? In the name of the United States of America, man. I don't know. Don't trust your fellow Americans, eh? Now you know how we Ruskia feel. In the name of Sayu Sovietsky Socialist Ichesky Respublik. Give me the parts, Jones. He's a commie! The parts will be safer with me, Doctor. Your friend is a gangster. What a choice. Sorry, Indy. And thanks. <sighs> Perhaps it's best, Jones. Your drugi have the machinery, but you have the satisfaction of knowing their betrayal will cost them their lives. Yeah, that cheers me up. Those ignorant fools know nothing of bubble, but I have studied, and I know that beneath the foundations of the tower, the cause of all the biblical turmoil waits to complete his designs on mankind. Who? What are you yammering about? Da. The Lord Marduk himself crossed over from the Ethereum to inspire the Babylonian priests. And Marduk, potent and malevolent to this day, will have his miest on those who desecrated the great machine. Luckily, you and I are professors at heart, too wise to become so easily ensnared. <sighs> and too timid. Back to our tea and books now, eh? <laughs> studying the place. Research money's tight these days, but with your connections, it's a sure bet. Forget your ivory tower, Jones. Here's our chance to save democracy. Let's vote on it. See you later. 
Rita Jones. Don't worry, Sophia. I'll think of something. I hope. What do you know? It worked. Turner, you've got the part I need. Hand it over. Sorry, can't do that. Andy, help me! Come on, it's our only chance to save Sophia. You don't fool me, Jones. Once you stop the commies, you'll use the machine to take over. That's your plan. The world's seen enough dictators, don't you think? You'll never get away. You can't win, Jones. Uncle Sam will thank me for this. Who dares disturb my slumber? Uh, that's me, I guess. Indiana Jones. Make me go, master. I may obey your wishes. The inscription reads, Thus do I lift man to new heights. Turner fouled up again. No, it worked. Two heads or something? No. Two faces, maybe. Pardon me? You were on Turner's side, right up until the end there. I never lied. I'm a professional. I was doing my job. I guess that's human enough. You bastard. Let's 
must live to tell this tale. Well, well. Reds again. Did you find God, Dr. Jones? I hope not. Whoever we ran into wasn't very forgiving. That's a relief. As you know, socialist theory disavows the existence of supernatural powers. And you expect to win the Cold War? I expect a long struggle. Listen, uh, Gennady, you don't happen to have any socialist vodka on hand. I'm thirsty. since I stood here. Hello, Sepito. You could have thrown me the whip, old pal. Think it over. Aha! Hmm. This might be important. Whoops. That looks a little too dangerous, even for me. That ought to do it. Another idol. Well, Belloc won't get this one. Uh oh. They sense a trap. I still can't speak Ovidos, but this time I guess it won't matter.